Well, generally, uh, the city of St. Louis has been very fortunate uh, historically. I mean, we've had immigrants that came into this country a hundred years ago and established the city and really uh, created the diversity that we do have here. Uh, virtually every type of uh, ethnicity you can think of uh, had, had settled in St. Louis. But, you know, just in the past 20 years, we've, we've noticed uh, immigrants coming from various countries, Vietnamese, certainly after the, Vietnami the Vietnamese War, a lot of uh, refugees from Vietnam were here. Uh, we're seeing uh, more recently, we've seen Bosnian immigrants, uh, immigrants from Mexico and Latin America. Uh, we're getting uh, a number of, of, of immigrants from Asia, various Asian countries, particularly China and Korea, but other Asian countries as well. Uh, and we're also seeing uh, more recently even uh, some immigrants from, from Nepal. These are Bhutanese refugees along the border of Nepal that, that come there in the United States and some from Iraq who have um, either employed over there with some government agency or um, some other agencies, uh, non-governmental agencies, and now have moved to the United States because of the issues that are going on over there. So we've seen um, a tremendous amount uh, is, in, relatively uh, for our recent history, a tremendous amount of immigrants coming into our city and our region, and we think that it's been uh, a positive addition to our community. Well, we'd like to think of our city as a city that is a welcoming a city, not just uh, tolerant, but uh, acceptable uh, to uh, and accepting uh, to people of different faiths, religions, and uh, ethnic backgrounds. Uh, we know that, uh, that this is becoming more and more of a global economy. People are moving more and more. And if we want to grow and prosper, uh, we have to be able to adjust to the, uh, the trends that are happening. Uh, people are moving more, and there are more people coming into St. Louis that want St. Louis to be their home. We have found it to be very, very positive. Uh, it, it has helped us. Uh, uh, rebound from our population decline over a 60 or 50 year period. We lost about 60 percent of our population. We've now seen our population increase. The immigrant community has helped there. Uh, people from various uh, countries throughout the world have come to St. Louis. Uh, a lot of them are professionals, engineers, uh, and some of them are uh, people who they start their own businesses, uh, bakeries and restaurants and other types of, of things. Uh, they're paying taxes. They're 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 taking care of our neighborhoods and and their and their families, and they have really been a positive addition to the city of St. Louis. You've seen communities like uh, Cherokee Street uh, really come back uh, with uh, mostly a, a Latino American community, Mexicans uh, predominantly. Uh, not just in restaurants and shops and things like that, but they've also helped um, revitalize the arts and antique uh, component of that uh, very diverse community over in, on uh, Cherokee Street and in that immediate area. There's some rehab going on over there, not just on along the strip, but along the perimeter of there. So it's becoming a more vibrant community. It's not too far from Benton Park, which is a popular neighborhood. And then, of course, uh, South St. Louis near the Bevo, Bevo Mill area, uh, a lot of Bosnian immigrants have, have come there. Uh, they're very industrious, hardworking, and um, really have fit in well to the community. Uh, you know, in, in spite of or despite the, the differences that in culture that people have, St. Louisans generally have been very accepting, and the people who have immigrated here have worked real hard to be positive, uh, to, to be positive uh, additions to our community and uh, we're very proud of that. One of the things that uh, we are proud of as well is uh, we were able to have in St. Louis, uh, the Bosnians constructed the first Bosniak uh, minaret in North America. So we have, it's one of a kind nationally and we're, and the fact that they were able to do that here and did it without a hitch or without any major problems uh, and I'm told quicker than they got their building permits quicker than they were able to get similar permits in Sarajevo uh, tells me that uh, you know we're doing everything we can to uh, you know show that we do appreciate them coming to St. Louis, making St. Louis their home, and being 
a integral and important part of our communities. Uh, what I tell immigrants uh, when I speak to immigrant groups, and I've done so before, is that you may have come from a different country, uh, but now you are here, uh, part of our community, our neighbors, uh, our friends, and our fellow St. Louisans.